Okay, all I've done is put some a uh, auto mat or auto carpet, four way stretch auto carpet on top of the lats and glued them down. I need a bit more glue because I want to tuck them around like that. And this is just to give air underneath and to protect the mattress. That's all it's for really. Uh, I also sprayed the wood with, where are we? Matte varnish just to seal it. That's all I've done, okay? My lad uses this, so it's very good. Uh, so I've tucked all the, that's all glued in. And neat there. And all the way along there as well. Nice, neat job. I've got this to do, I've got it to glue. So I'll do all that and tuck that in around the edge. Next thing I'm doing is measuring the cooker. So I'm going to measure underneath the distance. I'm going to measure the width, find dead centre, and then measure where I want it from the edge, a little bit further over from the edge from there, find the centre, measure what sort of hole I'm going to cut out, and then get the jigsaw working. OK, marked it out. Uh, measure this, give a little bit, because the edges just uh, bevel out slightly. Uh, and next for the sink. OK. I've measured four times, I hopefully only have to cut once. So we will see. Sink, cooker. Woo, let's give it a go. Catch you in a bit. <laughs> First attempt, perfect. If you can't see underneath, I don't know if you can, but anyway, it doesn't matter. There you go. So fit spot on and so does the sink. Yes, I've tried that already. So I'm just gonna tidy the edges up, get rid of the ink, which is fine because it's not it's not permanent ink. Uh, and that's the tabletop. Well, you're going to fit it. I'm going to fit it first. I'm going to um, fit the cooker in the, in the uh, build up sink afterwards. Okay, work surface fitted. Absolutely solid as a rock. I put a batten behind here. I needed to allow at least 15 mil uh, so that it would come forward over a lip and over these posts. Uh, then I've got another piece of oak which I've cut, I've not stained yet, and that'll go at the back there, and that'll be fitted. And that'll look, give us a nice little drop off, it's been there. Yeah. Sinks in, I've glued that in using salt fix um, around the corners, around the edges, put some underneath as well. Uh, I've got to fit, the, the cooker is in. There's a bit of a modification we've got to do to the cooker because when I bought it, it was said like it's compatible for LPG. When it comes, it's done for natural gas. So what you have to do, it, it does come with it. Quite straightforward. We're going to change the jets. So we'll change the jets. They come with it. And then there's something else. I can't think for the moment where it is, but I think you have to adjust the pressure coming in. And then it will run off LPG, liquid petroleum gas. Uh, but I will show you that in, a, in another video, or if it comes today, the part, I will show you that in this video. But um, here we will see with that. And then, yeah, that's where we're up to at the moment. Uh, today, I'm going to carry on spraying, spray gluing this and sticking this down. I've done that a little bit there because I was working on the kitchen part. So I will glue this back down. I will spray underneath and these will tuck under. So they look nice. The reason why I've cut it after I put the carpet on is to let the, bat the, the mattress breathe as well underneath. So I'll be getting underneath this in a minute, spraying all this. I'll show you that when I've finished it. And then we'll put the mattress on. And we'll put on the new sheets and whatnot I've bought and I will show you that all complete. Uh, what else today? Whatever I can do, actually. So that's where we're up to so far. Looking pretty good, chuffed to pieces. Looking quite nice. Then I've got to figure out some doors, some the side panels, no problem, because you probably won't even see them. But yeah, the doors, there'll be a section coming up here, which I'll hopefully do possibly today, each side of this. So it sort of separates the bedroom from the cooking side of it. And I'll also put a splash barrier. Well, this will come up here. Something like that. And we'll, we'll work it out. We'll work it out. Okie doke. So looking pretty good.